before I start this video, I'd like to mention that these are things to look at when trying to get spins and different ways to look out when spending spins. Welcome to the channel, in this video I'll be making a guide on spins. So recently I maxed out my spins in uh, Shinobi Life 2 and uh, this would just be a couple of tips on how I did it. There's not going to be something like special like cheat engine or something, it's going to be really basic on how I maxed it out. If I try and add in a code or something it will stay at 500 so this is basically the max. There are a couple things you can do to try and get a lot of spins in the game, well you can do things without you know really effort at all. You can do the daily missions, which might take you like an hour a day, which can get you around 20 spins, close to 20 spins. Depends on what quests you get. Once you finish enough daily missions, you will get like this little icon that pops up at the top that allows you to claim more spins. This will give like 20, 30 spins, I think. I'm, I'm not sure how much you get per rank, but every time you rank up, you start getting more and more spins. So that's one of the simple ways to get spins. Another thing I'd like to say is, if you get something that you need or want in the game, I wouldn't suggest spinning for everything, because that would just waste spins. I really only wanted Renegon and Sharingan. I gained that. Like, I gained Renegon after I spun for the rest of the things. That's why I didn't spin for more things. But that's basically it. I wouldn't suggest spinning for things if you don't really need them at all. Another thing is, I would suggest waiting for new KK Genkai's to come out so you have a like a higher chance of getting something good at least because I believe they're releasing like Shisui's Mangeki Sharingan or something I'm not really sure exactly what it is but they have a they have quite a bit of um, unreleased uh, Keke Genkai's if I scroll all the way down here you can see like uh, all these Mangeki Sharingan Eternal Mangeki Sharingan is not even released Tensei Gon, Momoshiki Renegon and a bunch of these that just recently got added to the page Rene Sharingan is what I'm saving up for, but um, if something else does get released, I'll probably try and spin for it. Because um, there's no point in just staying on max spins, in my opinion. Other things I would suggest is save up spins. Just don't waste them for no reason. Key part, like... I've wasted a lot of spins, and I've wasted 7,000 Robux altogether on um, Renegon. Which <laughs> I don't suggest doing. If you've seen my other streams, I spent like 2k Robux per day didn't get running on yeah it gets annoying I just didn't do daily missions or like try at all in this game to try and get spins that's one of the main things I should have worked on but yeah that was one of the parts that I should have continued on another thing you can do is like if you go to the main menu you can auto click there and that gives you daily spins if you have premium you can get like 30 spins at night if you have school or something leave it running then to get 60 spins really easy way to get spins in my opinion um, they have spin codes I think every 15,000 likes so I'm pretty sure they'll be releasing one already have released one recently so it's really easy to get spins in my opinion just keep just keep saving them up don't waste robux like I did I generally don't think that was the best way to go at it saving up spins was a lot easier I should have done that instead of like spending so much time um, wasting spins, blah, blah, blah. like wasting Robux, I mean, for no reason whatsoever. Just, just keep auto clicking and stuff, and you can basically get like 30 to 60, like 30, 30 to 60 spins like a day, or at night. If you have school and go to sleep, it's really easy way to get spins. Just keep auto clicking, and you'll get them eventually. Uh, for me, I can get around 16 spins. I don't have Roblox Premium. I don't buy it for personal reasons I just don't buy it um, I get like 16 spins if I leave it on at night wake up then I had 32 spins I kept doing that for a while doing daily missions that gave 20 spins per day so that was around 50 spins for me um, plus codes plus the ranks you can unlock it's really easy to max out spins I wouldn't waste them at all not not right now at least because I think around Friday there's gonna be a new KK Genkai update I'd save up until then that's basically it. This is all the information I could give on spins. There's no real trick to it. No hacks, no <laughs> cheats, no nothing. There's nothing you can really do as of right now. Maybe they might add in boss missions that get spins and like beyond. 
but that's really it thank you for watching uh, like and subscribe if that helped and see you on the next video